What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Next Gen Media. Here at Next Gen Media, we, uh, you know, let's just roll the intro, man. It's good to be back. So I apologize because I've been out of the game for like a month. I just moved into a new place. I, you know, I've just been pretty busy with that. It's good to be back and I'm coming back with some exciting news, guys. I just saw Venom. How did Matt get such an early screening to Venom? Uh, it, it doesn't even come out until October. Well, to answer that question, I just found it online. So I was just Google searching like Venom 2018 online and I saw a bunch of footage. Now, here comes the bad news is that it, it sucks. All right, it's a terrible, terrible movie. Terrible, 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 terrible. First of all, Sony's advertising fucks us once again because Tom Hardy isn't even in this movie. We cannot just hurt people. I know, he's not in it for a second. He got replaced at the last second with Topher Grace. It makes me happy. I was like, Topher Grace of all people? It makes me happy. It makes me happy. It makes me happy. So that was really off-putting. Not only that, but they said Spider-Man was gonna, you know, potentially make an appearance. There were some rumors behind that. He's in it for a ton of the movie. So that's the good news. The bad news is it's Tobey Maguire. Venom doesn't even have a big part. He just comes in out of like nowhere. He's like this side character and Peter Parker's a dick to him. You're trash, Brock. Excuse me? I'm gonna put some dirt in your eye. And then Eddie Brock is a dick to Peter Parker. Thought he'd really do that. See? Right there. You made a judgment call. You gotta see it as it is. And all of a sudden, Eddie Brock just becomes fucking Venom. And here we go. It makes me happy. They're like, I don't even care about this character. He's clearly thrown in to be some big bad villain. And he's pretty fucking easy to take down in this movie. He's so easy to take down. You think Venom would be a pretty fucking hard villain to take down based on what you know about Venom from the comic books, right? This guy is one of Spider-Man's toughest villains of all time. I mean, this guy is a monster. He has, you know, super strength. He has the webs. He has the, you know, the symbiote ability. And you don't experience that in this movie. It just doesn't do Venom justice. It makes me happy. <laughs> to be quite honest, guys, I was shocked behind this footage. And then the way Venom looked himself, he didn't even look anything like he did from the Tom Hardy Venom trailers. Now let's just dive into some specifics, all right? CGI. Subpar. Acting. Subpar. Visuals. Subpar. Venom is supposed to be like this, you know, this huge, alien, disgusting looking thing. That's not what we see in this movie, guys. Look at this. Look at this. I think Venom should be a little bit more intimidating than that, guys. But maybe, maybe that's just me. And the way they killed off this big villain was just so dumb. So Spider-Man realizes, you know, Tobey Maguire realizes, oh, he doesn't like sound. That's right, I remember now. So he starts banging poles together and it's going like ding, ding, ding. And then Venom's freaking out. And then he ends up extracting the symbiote from Eddie Brock. And then he takes one of Green Lantern's little lantern bombs and throws it at the symbiote. And then Tover Gray starts running over, no! And then he jumps into it and then they both die, done. Why was Venom even in this movie? Okay, I, I think it's time to come clean now. I know that I wasn't actually watching Venom footage, okay? I know I'm talking about Spider-Man, but you know, with Venom coming out around the corner, I think that it was appropriate to revisit Spider-Man 3 and revisit just how shitty Venom was in that movie. And I think while I wish Spider-Man was gonna be in this new Venom movie, I still think it looks pretty cool. I think Tom Hardy is gonna do a perfect job. I think he is a great person to play Eddie Brock. And from the footage we've already seen, I think he's gonna do pretty well. And I'm sorry for tricking you guys into thinking that I saw the, the new Venom movie, but. So before I sign off, I just wanna give a shout out to a YouTuber that I think is pretty cool, Mercer Morrison. 
I haven't worked with him or anything like that yet, but I've just been watching a lot of his videos. We've been commenting on each other's stuff. Um, just go check him out. I think he makes some really cool content and he does great movie reviews. So that's about all I have to say for this one and I will catch you guys in the next one. That, that, that's it. Goodbye. Go, go, I'm done. Oh my, go. Oh,